the Los Angeles Clippers will face the Dallas Mavericks in Game 1 of their series at Crypto.com Arena. The Clippers, with a record of 51-31, are coming off a loss to the Rockets. In that game, they shot 39.4% from the field and 21.6% from three-point range. Terrence Mann was a standout performer for the Clippers, scoring 24 points on 71.4% shooting. The Mavericks, with a record of 50-32, recently lost to the Thunder, shooting just 33.0% from the field. Brandon Williams led the team with 22 points but shot only 38.1% from the field. Both teams have had strong offensive performances this season, with the Mavericks averaging 117.9 points per game and the Clippers averaging 115.6 points per game. Defensively, the Mavericks allow 115.6 points per game, while the Clippers allow 112.3 points per game. The Mavericks are favored by one point in this matchup, with the over slash under set at 224. The predicted outcome is a close game, with the Mavericks winning 113 to 111. In Game 1 of their series, the Milwaukee Bucks will host the Indiana Pacers at Pfizer Forum. Despite playing at home, the Bucks are considered one-point underdogs. The total points for the game is set at 233. The Pacers are coming off a dominant win against the Hawks, scoring 157 points while shooting 65.0% from the field. Miles Turner was instrumental in their victory, scoring 31 points on an impressive 76.5% shooting. On the season, the Pacers have been strong offensively, averaging 123.3 points per game and shooting 50.7% from the field. Defensively, they force turnovers and draw fouls effectively but struggle in opponent points per game, ranking 27th in the league. Meanwhile, the Bucks suffered a loss to the Magic in their last game, despite Chris Middleton's 17-point performance. Milwaukee has a record of 49-33 and averages 119.0 points per game, shooting 48.7% from the field. Defensively, the Bucks allow 116.4 points per game and struggle against three-point shooting, conceding 35.6%. However, they are effective at forcing turnovers. Given their strong offense and home court advantage, the Bucks are predicted to win a close game against the Pacers, with a final score of 118 to 115 in favor of Milwaukee. In game one of their series, the Oklahoma City Thunder will host the New Orleans Pelicans at Paycom Center. The Pelicans are considered nine point underdogs for this matchup, with the over slash under set at 215.5 points. The Pelicans are coming off a victory against the Kings, where they shot 51.8% from the field and were led by Brandon Ingram's 24 points. On the season, New Orleans is averaging 115.1 points per game while shooting 48.6% from the field. Defensively, they force turnovers effectively but struggle in opponent points per game, ranking 8th in the NBA. The Thunder recently defeated the Mavericks with a dominant performance, shooting 55.7% from the field. Shai Gilgis Alexander had 15 points and 6 assists in just 16 minutes of play. Oklahoma City has a record of 57-25 and averages 120.1 points per game, shooting 49.9% from the field. Defensively, the Thunder allow 112.7 points per game and have a strong field goal percentage against. They are also effective at forcing turnovers. Given their strong offensive performance and home court advantage, the Thunder are predicted to win against the Pelicans, with a final score of 114-107, covering the 9-point spread.